Good morning. This is your Rise with Purpose video. It is April 28th, 2016. Uh, today's video I just finished doing on my bike ride here in the morning. And I, uh, kind of an observation I had this the other day. I might have done it in one of my videos. But I thought it was kind of funny that I'm out and I'm, I'm realizing I'm going to have to start doing this earlier. Because as I'm out, I run into about five different people. One person on a bike, one person walking, one person running. Uh, and two other people just kind of out casually strolling. But this is at like 4.30 in the morning. Literally, 4.30 in the morning. Uh... It's probably because the summertime is coming along, so how dare other people get up at the same time I'm getting up. Uh, anyway, just kidding. Um, it's a pretty good community. I'm actually pretty surprised if you do the percentages, if you're into that kind of stuff, which I'm, I don't really care that much, but if you were to do it, five people out of the thousands of people that live in the community that are up at 4.30 in the morning doing activities, that's not that many. It's a very small percentage, so anyways. Uh, Rise of purpose, what does that mean? It means um, really having a purpose, getting up, going for it, doing things. That's what I'm doing this morning. Getting up and moving, trying to recalibrate. I don't even know what happened. It, I'm sure the same thing's probably happened to you, but uh, this is literally the end of May. And we're coming on to, to uh, excuse me, uh, April, coming into May. And we have, uh, we're already one month into the second quarter and uh, it's already underway. So anybody that's doing any kind of business, entrepreneurship, whatever else, that stuff matters to you, the Q stuff. Um, so it's important that we, we really pick up and start moving here. I wanted to just push you to remind you that you got to keep showing up. Personally, I haven't posted a whole lot on social media. It's the thing I said, I think my last video, which was weeks ago, but, um, I'm still showing up. I'm still here, still rising with purpose. If you were here in my house every morning, you'd be up at 4am with me. Um, not kidding. Even on trips going on, uh, a few places outside of my home still up at 4 a.m. There's a few circumstances where it hasn't happened or have gone back to bed after I got up for a little while and did some things. doesn't matter. It's all about creating the purpose. There's no real specific thing. Um, I guess I'm kind of looping all the way around to the point I was thinking this on, the, on my bike ride um, about the fact that it's already been, I don't even know, six months, seven months, eight months, whatever. I was just kind of doing a uh, recollection of the amount of time I've been doing this rise with purpose, this up at 4 a.m. thing. And the reason it's still really just going for me there's one thing that I, I'm doing, or not doing, I should say, when it comes to this, that might help you on whatever journey that you are uh, doing or trying to accomplish. I, I kind of just threw out uh, the goal. You know, and that's kind of counterintuitive to what you might hear when it comes to achieving things. They always say, you know, dream boards, vision boards, goal boards, all those things. Have a goal, have a date, have all that stuff. And that's it's great, it's very true, it's important. But I've thrown out um, the excitement, the emotional attachment that I have to achieving the reward. There is no like, you know, I'll get up at 4 a.m. I know before I've said, and this is my goal, 4 a.m., this whole Rise With Purpose thing is my thing for 2016, so that's what I'm doing. Um, that's my point of trying to be impeccable, trying my best to show up and to do what I can do in my own life to walk the walk, right, that I'm sharing with you. I'm, I'm sharing not just videos I randomly pop up and decide to talk about. These are things that I'm practicing in my own life that I'm finding some results and that I share with you and how I'm doing what I'm doing. How you do it and how it might work for you might be a little bit different. Uh, you might not be able to step right into my shoes and do exactly what I do, but more than likely you probably can. Uh, or a variation of that works for you. That's what's most important is finding, it's rising with purpose for you. What is your purpose? That's the whole point. But I've thrown out kind of the whole idea of, okay, 60 days I'm gonna do this, and 90 days I'm gonna, uh, you know, I'm gonna have, I will have done it for 90 days. I, I don't really care. I just kinda, I, I know what I'm doing, the goal, the date, and the stuff is set. And then once that's set, I threw it away. And I just kind of, I'm just here. Just keep showing up. Because every day is going to be a struggle. Every day that you succeed and that you're like, yes, I did it. Well, guess what? You're going to go to bed, wake up. The slate is going to be wiped clean and you're back at it again. So what are you going to do the next day and the following day? And if you have all these, these rewards set up in your mind when you don't achieve them, it's going to really put a huge hit on your morale. So the whole point here is boosting your morale and keeping yourself going. If you can temper your emotions to the point where you don't get too, don't get overly excited when you accomplish something and don't get underly or, or overly depressed when you don't or when you fail. You just keep going. You just do this. You're just here. You're doing this and it doesn't matter rain or shine, whatever it is, you're going to find a way to make it work. If you miss a day, big deal because you're just going to pick up the next day and keep going. There's no week, missing weeks or months or falling off forever. You're going to make this an unwavering goal, and that's it. So let's we'll keep rising with purpose. Jason here. See you soon.